Coach, uh, Purdue size presented a big challenge for you. Uh, what was your plan to counteract that, and how did the plan change as the game went on? Well, we had multiple plans. Um, you know, really the best thing that they've done going into this game is shoot threes. And they've averaged 10 threes a game through their exhibition games and their first two games of the season. And, um, you know, initially we wanted to see if, if being able to take them off the three-point line and make them score tougher twos was something that would work for us. And I think it worked for a while. Um, but obviously we got into some serious foul trouble. And uh, we thought if we had to go small or in certain situations uh, throughout the flow of the game, if we wanted to throw a, a trap at Haas. Um, the problem with that is, you know, when we run at a kid like that, we don't obstruct his vision at all when you're reading. And he's a really good passer. And so when we did that, they end up getting threes. So it's, you know, definitely coming into the game, we, we thought it was a pick your poison game. Um, they're really good. You know, they know who they are as a team. Uh, they, they have an identity. Uh, the kids know their roles. Uh, they embrace it. And they have years of playing together where they're, uh, it's, a, it's a grizzled, hardened team. And those are all things that we're learning. Um, they're not in a learning stage. Uh, we are. And it seemed to really, well, at Media Day, you said about how this team needs to do more than just three-point shooting. It seemed like that mantra kind of played out today, especially at the first half. Yeah, the thing about them, though, is when you do take it to the basket, you, you, you don't score on the rim when he's in the game. Or, you know, the other big kid. Like, you know, when you drive the ball against them, you're, you're not going to score at the rim with big fella in there. And we, to start the game, I thought we tried to test that. Uh, and we failed the test. So, I mean, you want to drive and you want to get penetration. You want to hit the post. It's just that there's going to be another play after that. And it's not going to be at the rim. Because when you shoot it at the rim and those big fellows are in the game, they just they send it right back. Beyond not getting the win, isn't this the kind of game that you want to start the season, challenge your big men against the big guys like Purdue have, go up against a team that can do a lot of different things and learn a lot at this stage of the year? Yeah, I mean, we're, we're, we're very much evolving as a team. Um, you know, really with Sam, Marcus, and Andrew, you know, those guys have been key contributors on a good team. And these other guys are figuring out what it takes to do that. And that's not a, it's not a knock. Um, but it's just something that we're, we're in an evolution as a group. And so the roles of the guys like Sam, Andrew, and Marcus, they, they change and they grow. And the roles of the other guys, you know, they're f we're still figuring all that stuff out. So when you play against a team like Purdue, uh, you, they help you figure out things a lot quicker. And that's, you know, it's good if we use it the right way. So, um, you know, we, we, can, we can learn a lot from it, and we, we need to. And you mentioned Marcus. You know, he certainly appeared to be physically fine tonight, took a big step forward tonight in terms of his game, and he's another component that you're going to need to have step up as the season goes on. Yeah. No, that's right. <laughs> I mean, we need Marcus to be really good for us to be good. And uh, uh, I thought Marcus played well today. And, you know, we need to get, we need to get more help all around. Anything else? Thank you.